नेक्स्ट टेन पॉइंट सिक्स अ बीम ऑफ लाइट कंसिस्टिंग ऑफ टू वेवलेंथ सिक्स फिफ्टी नैनोमीटर एंड फाइव ट्वेंटी नैनोमीटर इज यूज टू ऑप्टेन इंटरफेरेंस फ्रिंजिस इन ए यंग डबल स्लीट एक्सपेरिमेंट ए फाइन द डिस्टेंस ऑफ द थर्ड ब्राइट फ्रिंज ऑन द स्क्रीन फ्रॉम द सेंट्रल मैक्सिमम फॉर वेवलेंथ सिक्स फिफ्टी नैनोमीटर बी वॉट इज द लिस्ट डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम द सेंट्रल मैक्सिमम वेर द ब्राइट फ्रिंज इज ड्यू टू बोथ द वेवलेंथ को इन साइड नाउ सी lambda 1 that is 650 nanometer so that is 650 into 10 raised to minus 9 meter lambda 2 that is 520 nanometer so that is 520 into 10 raised to minus 9 meter now distance of third bright for lambda 1 on the screen so the equation for the position of the bright fringe on the screen that we write x equal to n lambda capital d by small d for third one we can write x3 that is equal to 3 lambda 1 capital d by small d now substitute the values of lambda 1 small d capital d small d that is 2 into 10 raised to minus 3 meter capital d that is 1.2 meter actually in question the value of small d and capital d is missing one that is the printing mistake but it is there so now substitute all the values here and then solve you will get x3 means the distance of third bright for lambda 1 on the screen now suppose on the screen at distance x n 1th bright For lambda one and n two, bright for lambda two, superposed to each other, right? इले n one order नी bright, lambda one wavelength माटे नी, अने n two order नी bright, ये lambda two wavelength माटे नी, एक जिग्या ये form थाई छे. Means these two superposed. now when these two superpose it implies that the distance of both n1 and n2 that is same one so we can write n1 lambda 1 capital d by d that is equal to n2 lambda 2 capital d by small d d cancelled so n1 lambda 1 equal to n2 lambda 2 so n1 upon n2 that is equal to lambda 2 by lambda 1 So 520 by 650. So the minimum ratio that is 4 by 5 because here we want the least distance. So we have to consider the least ratio of this one. Means for lambda one fourth bright and for lambda two fifth bright superpose to each other on the screen. Okay. Now that particular least distance where these two superpose. so we can use either of these two x equal to n1 lambda 1 capital d by d n1 that is fourth one lambda 1 650 into 10 raised to minus 9 capital d that is 1.2 and small d that is 2 into 10 raised to minus 3 then solve this one you will get that least distance where these two superposing clear